Okay, recapping what we've got and why we've got it. So no testing this time, just have a look at the type of items that we've installed. Tresham College, lighting circuits are installed using one millimetre squared PVC, PVC twin and CPC cables. On site, often that cable size will be 1.5 for reasons of thermal insulation in roof spaces and fire ambient temperatures in roof spaces in domestic properties. So we will use one mil here, 1.5 on site. Open current protection device for lighting circuits is six amps for a circuit breaker. Those circuit breakers are type B circuit breakers for domestic installations. We've got the insulating material around the conductors is thermo plastic PVC with a maximum operating temperature of 70 degrees C. We've got our fluorescent light fitting, which is metallic, therefore is an exposed conductive part. Our consumer unit is electrical and metallic, so also is an exposed conductive part. We've got our switches. This switch here is controlling only our fluorescent light fin and is a one gang one way. We've got three switches controlling our baton lamp holder, so we've got two way, intermediate, and a two way switch. Please remember for switches of three and above, controlling one point, we have a two way switch at each end. And we can have as many intermediate switches as we like in between. So we can have 10 of these, each end two-way switches, in order to operate just that one light fitted itself. Our consumer unit is fitted with an RCD. RCD stands for residual current device. Uh, so our RCD is offering additional protection. We're going to have it rated at 30 milliamps in this case, or it has to be below 30 milliamps. So we've got a 30 milliamp device installed here. The RCD will operate under fault conditions to earth. Our overcurrent protection device rated at 6 amps, has a disconnection time of 0.4 of a second. Any device of 32 amps and below disconnects within 0.4 of a second. 